Yo, what's up? Today, I'm gonna be doing a tutorial on my chest whistle. Alright. So, a lot of people think that it is silver bass. Which, silver bass isn't really like that. Because silver bass has a weird overtone that comes out the bottom lip. And it do. Okay. And I don't have that. It's just a straight whistle with chest bass. So, a lot of people get that mixed up. Um, when I do it, it's just doing a really deep chest bass. And then, a whistle. So, first you're going to need to learn how to do chest bass. Which, there's many tutorials out there. And, whistle. I believe most people can whistle. If you can't, then it's going to be a little difficult. So... It's just doing chest bass and prolonging that, okay? To make it more powerful. <sighs> so you want to be able to hold it out longer. Because you don't want to be doing on the whistle. It's like... You want something more like... Okay. Once you're able to hold it out longer, you want to put your mouth in a position of a whistle. I don't want your tongue in a weird position as well. So like a kind of like that. You want it to be flat with the back of it raised. <coughs> and in the midst of that whistle, if you want to go higher, you raise it. If you want to go lower, you just flatten it completely. Other than that, I mean I mean there's variations. Um if you can hold it out long, you can go up and down with your tongue. Or change the formation of your mouth. And you can bring in your lower lip to get that. If you're into that. If not, then that shall conclude my tutorial. Thank you for watching. Hope you like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time.